Uh, hey Siri, send Laz, Larry, Larry Emder a text, waving hand emoji, coffee cup emoji, face with smiling eyes emoji. <laughs> hey Siri, <laughs> respond to Kylie. <laughs> Sm smiling face with glasses emoji, <laughs> bottle of champagne emoji, smiling poo emoji times ten, question mark, <laughs> kiss kiss, another smiling poo emoji. Um, Operator, we have a problem. We use them every day. They've become a, a virtual second language. And last week, it was announced 217 new emojis are coming to our devices. Wow, a face blowing out smoke, uh, a head in the clouds, adding to the current lineup of the 3,304 emojis. The new update is expected to hit our screen sometime next year. Okay, lots of curly hair there. Founder of Emojipedia, Jeremy Burge, joins us live from Liverpool in the UK. Welcome back to the show. Always great and fun to talk to you. Tell us about these newest additions. Uh, so there was a bit of a, an emoji delay this year where there was meant to be a big update and it got put off. So instead we have this update, which has, as you said, the, the face in the clouds. There's a face that's exhaling, sort of a sigh. There's also new hearts. Hearts are always super popular. So there's a heart that's on fire, a mending heart, sort of like the opposite of a broken heart. And then there's more other options that are on the way. Wow, inclusive, inclusive. Can you just say that word, Clyde? Inclusive, <laughs> inclusivity. Inclusivity, that's an interesting word. Uh, is the a message in the new releases, right? Variations in skin tone and, and, and couples. Uh, this has been a long time coming, right? Right, so there's been an effort to standardise the emoji set. So for a while there, there were emojis that only men could do instead of women. Now the skin tones are slightly an issue that some of them aren't supported on some phones for different genders. And now the new update allows couples, you can have a mixed race couple of any type, uh, any combination. That's 200 of the new updates. Well, you'll have to get a new, t I've just seen the t-shirt too when we lost the uh, strap underneath. You have to get a new t-shirt next year. While we <laughs> await the release, there's actually another update that should be rolling out any day now. What's that? Uh, so earlier in the year, there was a new update approved that is things like the bubble tea. It's got this gesture. And those are coming to most phones in the next month or so because of the change in the schedule, the COVID schedule, these ones haven't even come to phones, even though Unicode, the body behind all this, is already announcing the next set. So these are confirmed by Apple to be coming to the iPhone next month and yeah. they're on some other phones. You can say absolutely anything, can't you, with emojis? What would the collection of emojis be if you wanted to say to somebody, oh my God, your house is so tiny? <laughs> I mean, we've got a, the little pinching hand emoji, that could be quite good. Uh, yes, this is my, my boat house, which is quite small, but it, it does the trick. <laughs> it looks like you, you hopped on the uh, tiny home sort of uh, bandwagon. Looks great. Yeah. A tiny home that moves around, so it's even better. Like a, like a caravan. Uh, there's a lot of innuendo and double entendres when it comes to emoji use. Uh, is it ever considered during the design phase? Do they say, well, we reckon this is what it looks like, but this is probably how it's going to get used. Are there certain vegetables where that, you know, has come? So like tomatoes. <laughs> People are creative, right? So the thing is, it doesn't matter how much a company might want or not want an emoji to have double meanings and innuendo. I mean, the birthday cake emoji on TikTok means something completely different than in your corporate emails these days. So it doesn't matter what the companies try and do, people will creatively find their own ways to get around that. Okay, so ask I don't you, Larry. know how much of a concern Go on, Larry, right, ask. Um, Kylie's uh, <laughs> asked me to ask you this question, and given that I'm nearly 60 years old, I need to know things like this. What does the birthday cake emoji on TikTok mean? <coughs> Excuse me. It's, uh, <laughs> It, it's for it's for your <laughs> behind. It, mean, it normally means you have a particularly nice behind. Does it? <laughs> yes. Uh, sorry, sorry, kids, for ruining that for uh, for all the I youth didn't out know there. That's they'll, all right. they'll, have, they'll be under something new already. The morning okay. show is here to educate and inform. Yes, that's right. Uh, we want to play a little game with you, if that's okay. We've picked out some <laughs> of our favourite movies, and we want you to guess what they are. The catch: we've only used emojis to describe <coughs> them. Okay, should be this should be easy for you. Should Here's be. the first one. Oh, uh, oh I, I am awful at these. Devil dress, uh, devil, devil wears Prada. I've heard of this one movie before. Correct. I like, I like the way you went. Uh, I like the way you went loud with the thinking process to drag out the drama. We appreciate that. Let's have a look at the next one now. It's palm tree uh, and a simple white ball. Palm tree, volleyball. Oh, this one. Uh, what do you call it? What do you? Tom Hanks in Castaway. Perfect. Oh. Yeah, two from two. Oh, uh, this next one I think is easy. Have a look at this one. 
Oh, yes, please. Yes, um, like the flying glass fish. Yes, F Finding Nemo. Thank you. I'm oh, so glad to be so <laughs> I couldn't get it. I want to go spy fish. I thought it was, I thought it was burning <laughs> fish. All right, this, uh, this next one has an Aussie, <laughs> Aussie connection. Lightning bolt. Uh, light blonde yeah, guy. Man, a hammer. Yeah. Oh, yes. Kind of stumped on this one. Uh, think, an Aussie connection. Think superhero. Come on. Think Mar Marvel. Thor. Thor. Is this Thor? Is the it hammer? Thor? I hope it is. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what? And what about this next one? What, <laughs> what could this next one be? Uh, we've got a globe, monkeys, uh, planet, planet of the apes. This is fun. Can we do this for the whole show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this, now, th th this last one uh, stumped a few people in the office. Uh, have a look, and it is uh, something, and then a couple of other things. A speak cross that. This is speaker. a mute. Yeah, a mute symbol they call it. You know, just mute your speaker and two sheep. Uh, uh, silent sheep. Silent. Si silence of the lambs. Of course. Oh. oh. That's very good. Yeah, I would have got there eventually. Oh. Wow, oh. Oh, thank you. That was great fun. And here's another one for you. Uh, birthday cake, birthday cake, poo emoji. No, I just made that well, up. Thank Don't you. worry. That's Don't half worry. time. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I'll take time. It. Um, good stuff. Yeah. We will be keeping an eye out for those new emojis hitting our phone sometime in the new year. Jeremy, always great to talk to you. Oh, good, good to be back on. I'll speak to you next Thanks. time. This is a great house. It is great house. Got. Great house. Great T-shirt. Great game. Did you get my message Winning. before? Uh, I rejected it. I, <laughs> yes. I deleted it without <laughs> yes. even opening it. Fair enough.